Well, this is interesting. Hey folks, Nathan here. This is my YouTube channel. Lots of Star Wars content, but also some Let's Plays. I want to say this is the 902nd video on the channel. Holy shit. Um, but yes, we got two new PSVR games that came out today that I have picked up. I picked up Radial G Racing Revolved, and I picked up Raw Data. Or Raw Data, as the case may be. Um, checked out Radial G Racing Revolved earlier briefly. That is a racing game. Uh, it's about 28... Actually, no, excuse me. That one is... Uh, I'm trying to remember which was which. Either that one was normally... Yeah, that, I think that was normally 30. I think this is the one that's normally 40... And with PS Plus, it's like 28 right now. But basically, this and Radial G um, right now are both about 30. There's also an amazing PlayStation VR sale going on right now where stuff like Drive Club VR is like 6 or 7 bucks. Uh, I picked up Spark for 15 when it's usually 30. Fantastic sale going on. Goes on through my birthday, actually, October 17th, which is also the day you'll see the new edition of the Star Wars Timeline Gold come out, and I will launch my Patreon. But we are here for a quick Let's Play of Raw Data, or Raw Data, it is my first time attempting this. Got my move controllers going here, as you can see. And like Batman and many other games that have you essentially stationary, um, well, mostly stationary, we have sort of our framed area where I can work. And in this case, it's telling me, turn around, idiot, turn around. So I'll turn around. Calibrate height. Wait, how do you freaking know? Height calibration. Am I supposed to hold it at my side? Am I supposed to hold it over my head? How do you know what my height is based on me doing this calibration? Where am I supposed to be holding the damn thing? You lie. Movement style, okay. Will I have teleport or... Whoa! Interesting. <laughs> it's like a JavaScript pop-up. Whoa! Teleport only, classic style. Teleshift to move. Walk, directly control your... Oh! Oh! <laughs> directly control your movement. Melee enemies uh, will lunge towards you in this mode. And then we have left or right hand preference, which will determine button and weapon placement. Yeah. Woo! Seriously. You guys could have done this any way other than that. I'm just saying... Uh, duh, 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 duh. I'm not going to make me sick right there. And I'm still feeling it for playing Radial G. Just a little bit, though. Thankfully, this one does not require a bunch of movement that you can't control. That we know of. Loading. You're in? I don't believe it. <laughs> Activating now. Trying very hard not to turn that into a sexual joke. You're in? I don't believe it. Huh. Oh, well, wow. That's actually kind of cool. Graphically. It feels a little weird because of the way I'm holding the triggers compared to these, but I guess that's so that, like, and yeah, right now, my the balls are smacking together on the move controllers. Interesting. I like the look, though, and it's kind of cool, this idea of showing you, hopefully you can see this, um, I notice that sometimes it cuts off the bottom part of uh, what you see compared to what I see. But if you can see here, you got your arms. But instead of just being these little disembodied hands or anything, it's this idea that it's sort of becoming pixelated or whatever as it goes down your arm. Cool. All right. Whoa! Get to the kiosk. Timing's a factor here. Maybe tell a shift? Maybe, like, tell me what to do. All right, so don't hold, worry. move. Shifting is very safe, but I don't Can do it with both that, hands? Right? Who nope, just this one. Just days. your left hand. Relax. It's still your molecules it's that dark show as up hell. on the other side, mostly. Okay. Now what? Okay, so circle and Seriously, square are rotating me. Short range tell shifting was the 90 degrees. From Eden Corp. It's a little different so from the full circle version, is one, two, three, I'll four times. It seems like tele shifting is hey, using some power. Can you hear me? Look at the... Not good. Power's down. There yes. might be a manual override somewhere. See if you can find it quickly. They've probably learned to not leave their servers vulnerable since the last time. 
Oh no! I need to find a Manuel override. Manuel! Manuel! I think I've located Looking it. for the override, Next Manuel. The logo. You see it? Uh. Not really, because I wasn't really paying attention. Can you see the spinning E? Can I see a spinning E? Uh. That's it. A spinning right E? There. The Eden Corp logo. Override switch should be over there. I see the Eden Corp logo. I don't see shit that's spinning, lady. I can see it through your optics. Come on now. Lady? I don't know what the hell you're telling me. Oh, there it is. It just... So I'm standing over here and she's telling me... Go back here. She's telling me to go to that. Except that doesn't have a spinning logo on it until I get closer. I feel like I've got my money's worth already. There we go. Flip the switch. That's a hologram, woman. Just reach out and pull it up. I'll take oh. care of the rest. Up. Oh. That's why I got the funkiness. To my Seriously, it just feel weird the way that these hands work. Like this is me holding my hands take a normal. Look at that view. It feels incredible. a little bit like your hands are bullshit. bowed towards the outside. Eden assholes looking down on the rest of us. Yeah, assholes. What? Actually, their assholes can't look down. They don't have eyes. The eyes are actually nice higher. Job. Let there be light. We're oh. trying to find out about Eden Corp employees that go missing. Colors are changed. Promotion process, remember? These people volunteer and are never heard from again. Don't tell me these assholes aren't up to something. Okay, I won't. Get back to the kiosk. I'll place a beacon there to make teleshifting to it easier. It is kind of a cool feeling. I mean, it's another one of these rooms that feels expansive. The downside is that from a graphical... Just aim at the kiosk. Yes, I got gotcha, you, lady. Go Chill. It's the fact that, um... I just... I'm, well, what the... Surveillance is still an issue here, and we just turned the lights on. Move it. Okay, so if I aim at a beacon, a space that I'm supposed to go to, it can just jump me there. Well, that's not what I wanted to do, but okay. I was going to point out basically that let's go seriously Let's this is me this pointing business. the the ball directly at that mech looking thing over there look how it does the it makes more sense like this but as soon as my hands over like what is up with your wrist man if I booked a flight and did it myself damn she is more annoying than when sonic starts tapping his damn foot i got you lady sheesh greetings my name is simon I will be your concierge during your visit to Eden What do you Corp. say, Simon? But Ah, it's a damn tour guide. Please allow us to sign you in by using the hand scanner. We are thrilled to welcome our platinum investors to tour our facilities. Okay, do it. Use the hand I scanner. I'm currently awaiting identification. Please place your hand on the scanner. Which I'm assuming is this. Put your hand on the scanner. I'll run a dummy program that'll replace your biometric data with generic admin privileges. Is this the scanner or is that the scanner? I guess that's the scanner, but a moment ago it was showing me. In order for me to fetch the correct tour schedule, there. I need proper identity confirmation. Oh my. Greetings. Greet, 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 greetings. I am Max Headroom. G -g 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 greetings, friend. Executive underscore zero one. It is so lovely to have you back at our facilities. How are the kids? It worked. Couldn't get rid of the helper monkey though. You'll just have to deal with him. It's like Would Archangel. I got a helper in monkey. Participating in a number of our latest technology. That's how I feel, lady. What the? Go ahead. You should be safe as long as you're here. We've got to get you trained up before we get to the bottom of these disappearances, anyway. Excellent choice. I would be thrilled to show you the latest advancements in robotic combat. Can't move Please around. go to the product demonstration zone to begin. Alright, awesome. I will do that in a second. I'm just curious here, because this is the first time I think that outside of something like Netflix's VR app that I've actually seen regular video playing within a VR environment. Okay, so everybody's got to walk through the, the plants and, and like run their fingers through it. You gotta do that. Ever since friggin' Gladiator and Russell Crowe, you've had to do that. If you were ever in a wheat field or something, you must run your fingers through that long grass or whatever. There's a mech. What I was trying to say earlier was that it's interesting because up close, they look a little bit blurry on the texture. 
turns red, apparently. Um, but further away, they're blurrier. So again, you're probably seeing it a little bit better resolution um, in the stream because that's more of what the social output sees. Um, still a nice environment. It's just one of those ones where uh, there's so much going on that it's not amazingly crisp. And this is the pro. Well, let's hey! get started, shall we? Shall we? I see you I guess admiring we shall. Eden Corp's Prismagram technology. I am. Our prismograms display many forms of data. Oh, that's they're what those are. Interactive. Prismograms. We're currently running a bulk discount on these if you are interested. Like PlayStation VR sales? God, he'll try to sell you anything. How meta. Please select a demo from the list. Okie day. It's probably I'm gonna select. best to start with the pistol. Whoa, why is it going forward and backwards? Probably best to start with the pistol, so we'll start with the pistol. Excellent choice. This one is one of our most popular firearms. As you may have noticed, I have taken the liberty of attaching the pistol to your hip. Oh. Well, okay then. The Reforged Sled Driver by Eden Corp, or simply the Crusader. Well, that's kind of cool. Oh, brother. Features a so. phase flux discharge array and fires a 12 millimeter gravity jacket load. It does feel a little bit weird as far as the angle goes, but it'll it'll be something I can get used to fairly you may easily. Replenish ammunition with the magazine located on actually, your other the, hip. The angle feels the Eden Corp actually not bad. So if you think of yourself as pointing, it's going to be weird. Anything. But if you think yourself as holding the, safest way to the actual Eden grip of a pistol, it's actually pretty close to the regular grip. Sure like, um, like I've got a. A Smith and Wesson 40, um, uh, 40 count, a pistol, and it feels like about right. the same angle Let's as firing with it, only a little bit maybe twisted up. Hypothetical demonstration. So not bad. Eden Corp's most lovable companions would never I love the idea of such a fashion. That's pretty sweet. Die, you machine! No headshot. Okay, headshot then. If I can get it. There you go. Nice shot. Take that, Lore! When shooting, you learn faster than most executives I have met. Perhaps <laughs> I <I'm> become <laughs> a better teacher. Whoa! It, it apparently does so not dead. like it whenever I'm a gangsta styling. Mode. It has trouble tracking. I guess because I'm doing it in front of my face. Do what? Ability selector and move hand ability. So hold. For a nominal fee, uh, the Crusader can be upgraded to fire fully automatically. Nice. The options, that's how they get you. That concludes Angle this does feel a little bit weird. Please consult the menu for more options. Okay. Can I put it back in my holster? Oh, wait. Nope, he just took it away. I didn't actually put it back in my holster. Melee. Here at Eden Corp, I said, we are me, at the Pele. cutting edge of specialty personal defense weapons. Wow, that was bad. Uh, grab blade Reach over from your right shoulder and take a stab at this wonderful new product from your friends at Eden Corp. Ugh, is there any way to mute Simon? Ah, there we go. That time worked. You are gazing upon the Eden Corp I now rule and the Mandalorian Marvel, co-developed by our friends at Stratodyne Propulsion Systems. The Flash Blade has an advanced harmonizing Star Wars Eden fans will appreciate, you know. I did it all for my family, and then they left me, and I had to leave, and I became a ghost crew member, and ah! Cards. Channeling my inner Sabine. Teleport to Marker. What's up? This may be the closest to actual lightsaber combat that we're going to get in VR outside of Jedi Challenges, because Jedi Challenges is AR. If I can just stab. What? I've removed your blade. Bitch! Let's see what you can do with those fists. Not cool, lady. Not cool. Bring it. Oh, well, apparently, you can't uppercut. <laughs> <laughs> Which is what I was trying to do for that first hit when he slapped me in the head. Okay, that's my problem. I need to scoot over because I'm out of line with the camera. That was my issue. I'm not sure how to stop the demonstration. Perfect. Uh. 
Uh, what the? Hi. Hi. When These the things are tall. Try to hit you, try to dodge or duck. You are not an invincible nor an expendable asset to this operation. I. Whoop. You missed me. You missed me. Very nice. Dang, Good he job. took that hard. <clears throat> Again, my sincerest apologies. I hope this does not affect your. Oh, my blade with Eden Corp. I am sure we can work out an extra special price yeah. on the flash plate. Absolutely got to make sure that you're aware of your surroundings. Because what's happening is that I am turning, but when I turn, I'm facing away from the camera. And I got to a point where I was about two to three feet to my left of where I started and turned. So what was happening was basically that the camera was probably able to read the back of the headlights um, on the HMD, but not necessarily everything. So, got to remember that. Try not to actually physically move from your little designated area. Ooh, a shotgun? I call shotgun! Excellent choice. The shotgun is a favorite among executives. Left shoulder or right shoulder? I guess that's left shoulder. You may have noticed your what shoulder the? becoming heavy. I have holstered the shotgun there. What on earth? Uh, I don't think this is what he meant to do. Okay. For larger firearms such as this, Eden Corp recommends the use of two hands. The documentary drum. Oh, nice. Or Dominator shotgun is an exceptionally well designed product. It features a rapid feed linear breech assembly system that helps its handler deal with extreme cases of adversity. Good grief. That's kind of an interesting feel without having the PlayStation Move controller. Swing shotgun for one handed pump. Fire grenade from offhand, trigger, so... Oh, like that. Why don't you try shooting these helpless drones? It is important to note that Eden Corp would never weaponize a drone. Our drones are exclusively used for humanitarian purposes. Oh, of course. That's kind of cool. Kind of weird feeling doing this when you, of course, you've got two separate hands here. Um, there's no connection because, of course, you don't have the PlayStation Excellent aim shooting. controller being used. There's nothing more satisfying than pumping a shotgun, or so I've been programmed to believe. The Dominator is a wonderful option what is for home defense. up with my hands? That concludes this demonstration. If you would like to continue, please select the next demonstration from the menu. So, like, why do my hands look like this? Oh, there we go. It was just because of the shotgun, so apparently to use the shotgun, they gave you special gloves. Weird, but whatever. Bo? Instructions are on the interface, but I have confidence that you are capable of pulling a string. Lovingly known as Viper Strike, the Eden Now this is the type of gameplay I've liked since Medieval Moves Deadman's Quest. With the PlayStation Move and two Move controllers back on PlayStation 3. One of the few games that actually used uh, two Move controllers. Perhaps I was a little presumptuous. You will need to pull on the back of the bow to automatically generate a projectile for discharge. When you are ready, release this projectile into the modularized simulation environment. Yes, exactly the correct technique. Keep Ex at it. I know what you're thinking, but a good bow never goes out of style. I must admit that I do not quite understand the appeal. Take your time and aim. This isn't like the rest of the arsenal. Dang it. It's from the past. However, it is highly requested by our more affluent clientele. You're saying that so that it's not normal? You're saying I had to become I to someone else? I had to become something else? Grab and fire. Tagging arrow. Okay. Okay. Tagged. Now what? It would appear that oh, nice. Modern day William Tell. When you are ready to end the demonstration, destroy the drone cowering in the top corner. I'm not... 
I'm not a modern day William Tell, I'm a modern day Oliver Queen. Damn it, Barry. That's all you gotta say. You, to be Oliver Queen, you just need to say, you need to be unable to say the phrase, I had to become someone else. I had to become, or I had to become something else. I had to become someone else, or however it is he says it. And put the emphasis on the end of the some word, not the part that says some, which doesn't make any damn sense. And that way you'll be better at the opening of Arrow than, you know, the actual show entails. Whew, still feel like I'm losing my spot. I guess that's what this is. The arrow is telling me that that's the TV. All right, hit the one in the top corner. Done. Okay. My hands go back to normal again. That should be all of them. Yeah? What's this? Ooh! Field resources? Field tests. Configuration A, I guess. What the? That yeah, feels a little odd. The angle, that is. So how is it telling me about the resources? What are you trying to tell me about resources? I've been hit, so what's the resource? And that thing fell, and then another one just fell down in his place. How do I terminate? That's how I terminate, okay. So what good is that to... What? I want to figure out the tutorials. And it won't let me choose one. Okay, so maybe there's something else I'm supposed to do first. Ah, here we go. Notifications. Training session. Pistol. Go to the tutorial station. Are you serious? I have to go through that again because I didn't actually do it in the... I mean, not that I have a problem with practicing more, but that's some... Bullshit, yo! Yes, I know. Excellent choice. This one is one of our most popular firearms. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Well, that's interesting. It says only microphone audio is being broadcast. I'm assuming that you're hearing anything right now. Because I just got an error has occurred in the following application. Uh, CE-34.